Hey guys, uh, I'm going to make this as quick as I can. I just noticed that my shirt kind of blends into the chroma key, so we won't do any chroma key this time. Uh, what uh, I wanted to talk about was uh, lighting. And that's going to be one of the big issues for this little short movie is because it's pretty much all going to be in the dark. Now, I'm normally not too worried about day for night shooting because I would prefer to know that the scene is visible rather than worry about uh, whether or not I got the lighting to look like it was done at night. We're going to try to do this at night. We've got a pretty good camera. It's not the best, but we're going to have to really be on the lookout for noise around the edges when we're shooting. Um, there's a movie I want you guys to take a look at. If you haven't seen it already, it's called A Vampire's Tale. And it's not such a hot movie, and you don't have to watch all of it, just a few minutes at the beginning. But uh, what was interesting about it was the tremendous job they did on the lighting. Now, this is not a, a high-budget picture by any means. Shot back in the 90s, and I'll post a link to it. In fact, all of these pictures I'm going to talk about down here in the, uh, in the links, well, in the information section down there. Uh, the other thing I want to talk about has to do with directing and editing. And there's two pictures I want you to take a quick look at. Like I said, you don't have to watch the whole thing. I don't think I could sit through the whole thing again. Um, the first one's called Midnight Mass, and it is a vampire movie. Um, I think they started out with a pretty good idea, but where they ran into problems was with the script. The dialogue isn't that natural, and we'll cover that later on. Um, the directing is a problem, and I think if you watch it, you'll see what I'm talking about, that the vision just wasn't there. The director just wasn't, well, they keep saying, well, it was his first project. I don't care. If you know what, if you, you know what you want it to look like, then you should be able to translate that to, to the camera. Um, the editing. I want you to take a look. Maybe watch eight or ten minutes of this thing and tell me you couldn't cut almost half of it out and still have a, a, a picture that makes... Well, I shouldn't say makes sense, but a picture that, that actually works. Again, a link to that will be down there in the, uh, the information section. Lastly, I want you to take a quick look. You don't have to watch the first part of this. Now, this is the 1985 version of Alice in Wonderland that Irwin Allen produced. Now, yes, I know, these are pros. Harry Harris directed it, who had worked with Irwin for years, who did a lot of episodes of his television shows. And the main thing I really want you to see is what it looks like when a pro does it. Watch this without, unlike watching, going to the movies, just take a look at what's going on. In fact, turn the sound down and watch what's going on. Um, the establishing shots, the way they pan, um, the cutaways, and remember, they did all that on film. Now, cutaways and inserts should be a lot easier today, and there's really no excuse not to use them. And I want you to contrast that back to the Midnight Mass. Uh, we can have any kind of discussion you want right down there in the, uh, in the, um, the, the uh, comment section. Uh, we had a pretty good discussion going on our last video, and I would like to see that continue. Now, uh, one of the things that came up on the last video was a discussion about uh, the movie The Dog Soldiers. Gosh, I want to see it. I mean, it sounds really good, and it's a werewolf movie. The only problem is I'm not going to see it. I don't want to watch anything that really has something to do with the project I'm working on. I don't know, that's just a quirk I've got. But as soon as we get done, I'm going to seek that movie out or buy it or something. Anyway, if you get a chance, take a look at some of these things, and I'd like to hear what you guys think. Especially, now, you know, let me say the first thing, that Vampire's Tale, the, uh, the lighting in that. Um, any tips anybody's got about shooting at night, I'd be, I'm all ears. So, And in their case, they're all teeth. Anyway, uh, till next time, that's going to have to do it.